Welcome to Stamford Bridge here in West London. And when you think of the Battle of the Bridge, you think of 2016 when Chelsea officially ended Spurs title hopes with a 2-2 draw. Chelsea against Spurs today. Derek Ray alongside Stuart Robson here on the gantry. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing? Well, first of all, Derek, the atmosphere inside the stadium is incredible. And what a game we have in store for us. These two have become really fierce rivals in more recent times. And I think it's fair to say they don't like each other very much. And it's a team full of stars and you never quite know who is going to pop up and shine. Perhaps, Stuart, it'll be Raheem Sterling today. Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. This is how it looks for Chelsea. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Well, they're matching up here, so midfield domination will be key to winning this game. If they can manage that, it will then allow their fullbacks to join their attacking play. And now they get the ball rolling. Brennan Johnson. And space to cross it. Decent position. Bisuma, really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. And they're going for the short one. Angles it back. Connor Gallagher. And Sterling has it. And defensive play to be applauded. Johnson. That's a good looking ball. But the flag is raised, and that brings this move to an end. Well, he saw the pass, but he just couldn't get it away quickly enough. Jackson. Mudrik. Pedro Porro. Bisuma. It's with Porro. Well, good run and good ball control. And players waiting in the centre. Very quick thinking there. Room to Rome for Chelsea on the wing. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. 
Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? And short it is. James Madison. Johnson. How about the cross? Now they stopped them in their tracks. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? And the flag does go up offside. totaling up all the stoppages we'll have two additional minutes Connor Gallagher and so the first half draws to a close here in West London Raheem Sterling whose timing is generally so impeccable but he is one of his own biggest critics is he going to be happy with this performance well I've been disappointed with him in that first half he just didn't have an impact on the game Yes, the service into him wasn't great, but his movement needs to be a lot better. Let's hope he improves in the second half. And the contest begins. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Has the strength to hang on to it. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Dejan Kulusevski. Well, failure to keep the ball by Tottenham. He continues his run. Bisuma. And a poor ball. Sterling. reading it absolutely superbly Son determined defending Son. He takes aim, and the keeper more than equal to it. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Can someone get on the end of this? And making sure it wasn't problematic. Son. And still looking for space. Now, who can he pick out? Bisuma. Chance to take the lead. And a goal! Just when we wondered if this might finish nil-nil. There it is. They're in front. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end. But his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most.
What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Mudrik. Ten minutes to go. The clock is not on Chelsea's side, but it's not over for them. And just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. Well, it's frustration for the manager. That should have been the equaliser. James Madison. Promising move from Tottenham. Madison. Son. And a fine piece of goalkeeping which keeps their hopes alive. Well, you're right, that keeps them in it. But can they find an equaliser? They need some urgency in their play. And he's fired over the corner. And in a crowded area, the keeper has managed to get there. So the final whistle, and Chelsea take nothing at all from this fixture. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, I think as we reflect on the game, we can say that Hyung Min Son will have pleased as manager. Interested to get your thoughts on his contribution? Yeah, he deserved to score the winner today because he was a real handful. He's running off the ball and awareness of space were excellent. Very impressive.